Are you fucking kidding me right now? Hello, welcome to the Manager Selection Project! Yee! Woo! So, ladies and gentlemen, so, episode 7 now. So, we're literally halfway through to the season already. And I'm pretty sure this second half of the season is where we really get to see the drama regarding to Sidney's situation with the heart, of course. Well, you can say last episode, well, despite the fact we get to a very fan service episode with the Sunsu, of course, as a power of the idol culture, of course. Well, you can say the fact that I am actually quite concerned with Sidney right now because, you know, she was kind of overreacting regarding to her situation with the heart, of course. Well, we all know that she you know went through surgery and you know basically the doctor said she needed a heart surgery but he didn't specify what sort of heart surgery maybe heart transplant or just fixing part of the heart of course well one of my friend reactor friend real Shin react actually mentioned this to me during the podcast that i did like uh, two days ago that apparently there is a sign that his name may actually come to near her death and stuff like that so basically he, she's dying yeah basically there's a theory that maybe the reason why she was kind of overreacting that's why she was acting like what she did at the last part of the episode was because you know she didn't want to hold them back because you know her heart is really putting a strain on her and that she, maybe she's coming near to her end or something like that but i doubt it won't, we won't go into that sort of dark of the story of course but who knows man anything goes right now maybe she has a heart transplant of Rena's sister heart which i've been specifying quite lately of course so yeah there's a lot of theories regarding this in a situation but for now let's just see how today's episode gonna explain the situation of course so with that said let's get the rushing shall we Okay, my teacher, and let's get started, shall we? So, let's just see how will Susanne bounce back from this. Well, you can say pretty, pretty much with the power of friendship, maybe that's why she'll bounce back. We'll just see, man. So, here we go. Okay, off to where we left off in the post credit scene. I think every episode there's gonna be a post credit scene, so don't skip on the, cre <laughs> no, the credits, I guess. So, is she gonna sit here under the rain? Anyone can come here and take cover for her? Yeah, you can tell that she's really depressed right now, man. But I'm pretty sure with the help of the girls, she'll get back to her feet. Or maybe with some family support, maybe. Hey, they're here. Of course. Hmm. I mean, of course. Hmm. Mm hmm. I mean, that's what everyone would say. Oh, yeah, it's not your fault. It's our fault for not able to re realize your problem. Hmm. I mean, of course, they had to say something like that because you show her the support, I guess. Hmm. So basically, her body is like not doing a favor for her at all, man. What do you mean by that? Oh, I think this episode we'll find out what happened, what's going on with the body after all. Hmm, let's go. Let's go. Backstory time. Now, this is what I want. Mm hmm. Yeah, okay. Are you sure it's progress though? Or is there, is there like some sort of like side effects to the surgery or anything? Hmm. Oh! Oh my! I I knew it! I knew it! Heart transplant! I caught it! I fucking caught it! Oh my god! Yo! I caught it! I fucking caught it, everyone! It is a fucking heart transplant! And who is that person? Who is that person? I want to sing. Oh my god. Mm hmm. Oh, so that's why she feels pressured now. Now it makes all sense why she say, Yeah, I don't deserve this because I have the person's heart, and that person's heart is. Say it. Who is it? Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. No, it's more than that, man. Mm hmm. It's more than that. <laughs> Is she gonna tell them whose heart she got or something? She, yeah, we know it's a heart transplant, but whose heart is it? We can't have an idea, but she's all down to her exposing it. Oh my god.
Mm -hmm. Yeah, she's about to fall out, I guess. Maybe that's why she can't falter. Because the heart is not doing her favor. Maybe the heart responding to the situation, maybe. Okay. Time to have some theory. Yeah, I mean, of course, man. If one member is, like, depressed and not doing well, it will affect the whole group. So that's why the girls are not able to, like, you know, take off from there. So, yeah, it's all down to how, to, you know, it helps Dine get back to her feet, man. <laughs> yeah. I know, right? She's just feel responsible. She feel like the hard situation is really playing a big part in this now. Mm -hmm. So I I'm pretty sure it will be uh, it will be Ren now, be the one to like you know, get her back. To hey, the we said at least half of the face. Okay. Mm hmm. <laughs> mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I mean, you have to do a job as a mascot, though. I mean, you can see that he's really caring about Susan Ed, though, rather than just be a very forceful mascot. Mm hmm Huh? Mm -hmm. <laughs> I mean, of course you have to care, man. You just have to be in character during the camera, though. <laughs> mm hmm Mm hmm <laughs> Low, he don't show his face. Exactly. <laughs> Maybe he has a very interesting face. That's why I don't want to if he don't want anyone to recognize him. Maybe she was the former manager of, you know, Bernard's sister, maybe. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh. Mm-hmm. Oh, Juma Sake. No, 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 no. He can figure it out. I knew it. Yo. Oh. Exposed. Exposed his history. Wow, okay. So he was a former star or something. Wow, okay. That's him, huh? What the fuck? <laughs> what the hell, man? Yo, what? He's a idol ish again? <laughs> so he's a beauty man, I see. He's a beauty man. I used to be his paparazzo. Really now? Mm hmm I guess so. Well, exposed, I guess. Well, at least we now know what he looks like now. <laughs> <laughs> yes! So we find out his true identity. Mm hmm Mm hmm Mm hmm Like what? Cheer her up? And now they're back to topic. I mean, why not wear what Alchan wears? Something to cover his chest. The so Rena's gonna step in, I guess. Of course, she has to be Rena, man. Of course, it has to be Rena of all girls to be the one to cheer or season it up. Because, you know, those two were rivals. And you know, and we're the same group too. But also, Rena is the one that kind of understands her better. Mm -hmm. Mm 
Mhm. Okay. Oh ho ho. Mhm. Mm mhm. Mm so it seems like she has a heart donor card. So that means like basically if she dies her her body will be donated. Her part of her organs will be donated. Mhm. Mm Wait. Oh, wait, what? Hmm. So it seems like there's a letter written to her by a donor. Wait, so how did she manage to acquire the letter though? Okay. So that's the donor's family letter to her. So it's not going to be her sister then. That would be something else, I guess. Well, okay. It seems like this is quite a turn of event, I guess. I, I guess my theory is kind of out of the, the back now. Yeah, I see some of my theory going to be out of the back, but we shall see. Mm hmm I mean, yeah, that's the only thing you can do right now, I guess. Mm hmm Mm hmm They got me. Mm hmm I'm still surprised that Zinna is 14 years old. With that look and with that body, she's 14 years old. Like, wow. Damn. She's well developed, man. Maybe the body's like responding to the organ. That's why you had to develop quickly, I guess. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Okay. Okay. Wow. So she got like a loyal fan. Mm hmm. A loyal fan, huh? Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Yeah, sure, I guess. Damn, I gotta say, that's a loyal fan, man. That's a loyal fan. Dude, this is the best feeling, man. Having a fan giving you the support is just, like, beautiful indeed, man. Absolutely beautiful. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I do wonder who's the, who's the donor for season A, though. Theory a theory, that could be Narena's sister, though. So... Let's just see, man. Let's just see. I mean, that letter was enough to inspire her to get back to the feet anyway, so... Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Yep, the views from our viewers, from our fans. <laughs> I mean, took you long enough to realize. Mm -hmm. Well, it's just one fan, man. Just one fan to give it a push. I can relate to this big time because I, I have a subscriber that said the same thing to me. Give me the push to like do what I do. Mm hmm. Happy days. Hey, at least everyone's happy you're back now, I guess. 
Mm -hmm. Wow, I just wonder how long that would last. I mean, I guess she's back now, everyone. Everyone's supporting her. Oh, good stuff, man. This is some good stuff right here. The power of friendship, everyone. Let me guess the founder of Sweet Super Her or something. Um, oh yeah, I think the ribbon covers it. Yeah, I think the ribbon covers it. I mean, you still can expose the top though, so it does mean you know, sexy, I guess. So yeah, they managed to find the uh, Sweet Super that fits her. Basically, the ribbon covers the scar. Mm-hmm. 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 You don't live up to it. Dude, that is just good stuff, man. You have to like, you know, show your potential. Keep fighting again. Keep performing. Mm -hmm. Don't disappoint your fans, man. That's the thing. Don't disappoint your fans. Mm -hmm. And she said thank you. Oh, there we go. The the program to tell her the the feelings, man. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Aha. Mm hmm. Good. Mm hmm. Yo, let's go, man! Oh, we're all in this together! Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm -hmm. Well, I'm glad he's happy, I guess. <laughs> Well, wow, time for some music video, another CGI work, I guess, or not. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. I'm pretty sure everyone will pass, though. Yeah, I feel like everyone will, will all pass, except uh, Cincinnati needs a big time to boost herself. So that's that's why I think Cincinnati will be in the center stage. In order to boost the votes. Mm -hmm. Oh, let's go. Hey, hey, hey. Oh, let's go. Yeah, they get blue. My girl, Mako. Hey, 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 hey. Hey, whoa, so well synced, man. Hey. Hey, hey, hey. So I went from very depressing to a very enlightening music video, I guess. Hey, let's go to the swimming suit. Hey, yo, it's in the middle, man. Let's have some party. Oh my god, yo, Rena. Whoa. Uh, hey, hey, hey. Look so stylish, man. I gotta say, let's go! Wow, let's go! Hey, yo, dude, this music video kind of reminds me of the one stand for AKB48, though. Hey, uh, yeah, uh, hey, 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 uh, whoa, out, chat, yo, girl, get in there, man. 
Hey, hey. Yo, all them look so good in the swimsuit, man. Uh, say it. Say it. On your high thick blue. Way. Nice girls. Mm-hmm. 100, 100, 100, 100. This is the net. Come on. Yeah. Everyone pass! Let's go! Like I said, this didn't have to be in the middle in the main center of the group. Oh my god, she's smiling too! Oh my god, Renna's smiling, man! Holy shit! To the family. Kokazuku, Minasama. I'm happy that she passed in the end, man. So happy for her. Of course, there's a post credit scene. Of course, there's a fucking post credit scene. What is it? What's some special announcement? I have a bad feeling about this though. Mm -hmm. No one is eliminated. Mm -hmm. Well, I, at least I'm making history. Mm -hmm. Your life's here. Final screening. Mm-hmm. Will be... Will be what? Hope it's not that bad. Final live performance by seven selected candidates. Wait, final seven? Live performance? What do you mean by seven? What do you mean by what that? How? Wait, what? Bruh. Vote? What are you fucking on about? Are you fucking kidding me right now? Yo, that's not cool, man. Vote? Of all things? What the fuck, man? Seriously. Why? Are you fucking kidding me? I'm, I, I'm, dude. Vote of all things, dude. All they were good. How are you supposed to select who who goes where? Might as well all of them could leave or something like that. Because this is pathetic, dude. Are you kidding me? We're at the final. We are only at, on episode seven, and we are like literally at the final screening already so i'm pretty sure this next two or three episodes is going to be the build up to the final screening and the girls trying to figure out who goes and who who stays i guess two stay two leaves man like dude that's not fair man are not this so well to this point and now you're all down so vote is, is he really that desperate to eliminate some girls to create some drama oh my god this won't this won't go well man this won't go well with the fans at all man so they better have a way around this, man. They better do have a way around this because this is pathetic. Absolutely pathetic. Like, what the hell, man? Like, dude. I, I, I can't believe it. This is, this is the final screening. Two eliminated and only seven able to compete in the finals. Is he really that desperate to eliminate some girls? Because like, you know, the first screening, second screening fails to eliminate people. Because there's too too many. Uh, oh, whatever, man. Whatever. Let's just see how the girls have to find a way around this, man. I'm pretty sure they will find a way around this, man. Like, all all nine of them will be able to perform together. I mean, if two left, though, they will come back, I guess. Because, like, you know, the girls say, you know what? This is pathetic. Let's let's just, you know, all leave then. If, if this is, like, going to be the final screening. This is unfair to the other two, man. Like, they did so well to this point. I, I have a feeling that the first thing next episode will be Susanna will be the one being targeted i don't i i would not saying maybe because of her heart situation but because she's like the one that being kind of standing out for like not able to be doing well amongst the group i guess it, because this episode you can see the fact that she needs a bit of a inspiration to get back to her feet of course from her fan from from rena from you know, the girls so of course it's easy to say 
yeah, Susanne will be the first one to be targeted because of the how she's been performing this past, you know, two episodes, I guess. And of course, how how she enters the competition too, because you know she was being pitied to get to by Sarah to allow her to re to re to you know take her place. So yeah, I won't be surprised if Susanne will be the first one to come to the mind to be eliminated. But who's the second girl? Well, we shall see, man. So yeah, let's just go back to this episode, shall we? But well, we can say it's what you expect from a very, you know, friendship is girly sort of situation. That today find we find out more about Susanna's situation. They just need a bit of inspiration from the people around her, from you know the fan. We also find out about the mascot's true identity. I mean, that was the fun part, by the way. But that's not that doesn't really play a big part, to be honest. Unless you can say that his I because of his history with Idol. He knows how this whole thing works, even though he only released one single. So, I mean, yeah, you can say the swimsuit video looks really good. All of them wears not sexy swimsuit, but at least it's decent enough to be exposed on a you know, music video, I guess. Of course, you know, Susan has to be the one in the middle to you know raise the votes. And so, I mean, I'm happy for them that they're able to perform a music video like this because you know I've seen a couple of music videos before, like on like for regard to swimsuit. It's really fan service, man. But this one is like okay, to be honest. So I'm happy that Susanna got back to her feet. Everyone is happy. Everyone helped her out and stuff like that. But again, though, Susanna has to be the one that being pitied. <laughs> so it's, I feel bad for Susanna, though. I mean, I can't can't understand though because no, she 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 feels that like she doesn't belong here because again, though, like she was given this opportunity by Sarah, and of course she has her heart situation, uh, you know, really pulling her back, I guess. But again, though, with a with a bit of help from the fan, you know, you know, of course, we learn more about the fact that Rena has a donor card, and you know, when you have a donor card, you, if she anything happens to her, like you no, know, she dies or something, her or part of her organs will be donated. And so, going back to you know Rena's situation regarding to, I mean, since in that situation regarding to her heart transplant, oh my God, yo, I fucking caught it, man. I fucking caught. I mean, of course, some people also, also caught it too, but some people think that, you know, Susan had a heart surgery based on like fixing part of the heart and she doesn't have a long to live. Yes, Rushin React, I'm looking at you right now. Uh, but yeah, you can say I was right though, heart donor. And well, I didn't, I don't think they specify who's the heart donor. I thought for a second that it won't be Rena's sister, but it's still a possibility it could be Rena's sister. So yeah, I mean, of course, you know, they have a letter written by the donor telling Susanna to, you know, you know, she haven't read it yet, I guess, but there's a heart, you know, there's a letter saying that, yeah, you know, Susanna, you go and live your life and stuff. That donor is here for you to have a second life, in a second chance in life and stuff like that. So I'm happy that, you know, Susanna got a heart donor and you can say the fact that, you know, she's been given this opportunity to sing, but the, what, the, the reason why she's able to sing so well could be the donor effect though because like i don't know because it's, it kind of reminds me of idol reply you know the, the idol anime at the start of the year which i gotta say was quite mediocre into the last into the into the last part of the episode i mean the last part of the season but you can say like yeah you know maybe she's not able to sing well and that's why she's able to perform well to, to the final stages of her regional selection is based on because he has the donor ability, I guess, and which could lead back to you know Rena's sister maybe. But I gotta say though, I won't be surprised if that's the case. But again though, I kind of raises so many questions to why Cecilia is able to do so well and why she able to make it this far. But also because you know she the reason why she can make it she can make it this far is because she really you know just the fact that she really been very passionate about being idol and just you know find ways to get back to her feet with the help of others but how much longer that will help her out because now we're at the stage of elimination guys we at at the stage of elimination and this is where shits go down girls will start turning on each other i mean i don't think they will go to that sort of side of things but who knows maybe there is some girls like the old joe someone maybe you start to get greedy and you know stuff happens i guess because like we're still halfway through to the season so, I mean, obviously this build up though could easily be the, 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 like the final three episodes of the season, but nope, we're still halfway through the season. So something must be going on for the, for the next seven episodes, for the next six episodes to build up to build up to the final episode, which will be the grand performance, maybe something like that. So 
I don't know, man. Let's just see how it goes next episode. Because right now it's all theory and stuff like that. But I mean, that's a good thing about being an original anime after all. But we shall see, man. So with that said, hope you guys enjoy my reaction. Smash that button, guys. And I'll see you guys.